it to the cup and get it down low to, to and that's one thing we talk about this Cabot and Gale. That's one thing you don't want to do. You're a big guy. You don't want to put the ball down. And look at Payne. We talked about it. Look at that. But the great, you can see the defense great adjustment. Payne's a great player. Look at Payne. Nice dish right there. So now the Clippers want to continue to apply the defense. And that's not a great play. Great slam on that play. Make them go deep into their shot clock. Don't give them an easy possession. and Make sure you get the defensive rebound. And that's the guy, if you're the legend, you want shooting the ball. And they're going to say that shot was good. As I said, the Clippers, a second-half team. That This lead for the Legends, which was once 12, is now only two as Payne gets to the cup. That's a guy, again, so 10 seconds on the shot clock. So the Clippers, if you, get, you want to get a stop here as well. As the Clippers find themselves down by four. And that was a good shot right there. And Payne, as I said, he's a guy that can play basketball, sizing up J.J. Look at the first step. Gets to the cup. You talk about such an arc. Great ball rotation by the legend. Nine seconds to go in the shot clock. And just gets it right point blank. It's Payne gets there. Couldn't get that one to go down. And Payne wide open. And that was that. The Clippers, they are fortunate on that. And here's Coffee. What's Coffee going to do? Coffee. Oh, nice block. Nice recovery. But now with the Clippers. And now the Clippers, you want to apply. And that's something you cannot allow Matthias to have a shot that wide. You certainly don't want to give up a three here in this situation. As Payne gets it up, kisses it off the glass, and just like that. But here's a good look at Payne. Kisses it off the glass. Just so skilled along the way.